Want to keep up with the latest Garrett Plays videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. If you want to see extra content, join our Patreon page. Yo, people, get you in here for another video. So, guys, this video, um, I just want to say before we start is that it, it is pre-recorded. If you guys didn't know, I am away for a few days. So, this video is going to be probably a little bit more um, of a short video in comparison to some videos. We'll, we'll see how long it is. Um, this one actually might be the longest one out of all of them uh, that are being uploaded when I'm away. But I'm just away for, um, I'm going Friday night, and then I'll be away Saturday, Sunday, and then pretty much all of Monday. So, yeah, actually, actually, and surprisingly, I have a lot of stuff to do Tuesday. So I'll probably be pretty much away Tuesday as well. Um, but, so guys, before we get started, though, I want to ask you guys a question. And that is, have you ever traveled outside of the country uh, you were born in? So whatever country you were born in, uh, have you ever traveled outside? You can tell me what country you were born in. You can choose not to. It's fully up to you. Uh, but just, have you ever traveled outside of the country you are born in? And for me, the answer is yes. Uh, I live in Canada. I was born in Canada. But I, yeah, no, I, I, um, I, I've been to like a ton of countries actually. Uh, recently, mainly just like the U.S. But when I was younger, I was all around the world pretty much. So guys, either way, let's go ahead and get started. So this video is kind of cool. We have some new, some new mods. You kind of just saw a little glimpse right there. But boom, there we go. So in this video, we're gonna be transporting two shipping containers that have. Um, some Can-Am quads in them. So, uh, yeah, we needed a vehicle for it, and this is the one I decided to use. It is brand new. It is, again, guys, ATC, the person who made all of these, or the group who made all these, the ATC brand. Um, but yeah, so we have, oh, here, this is what it is. Absolute Transportation. What? Absolute Transportation? Co oh, oh, interesting name. Okay, but yeah, so we can hold a 20... Uh, foot trailer right there and then another 20 foot trailer right here although this one kind of looks smaller I think I think it's fine because yeah it's from here to here right I don't, I don't even know this, this, it should be good okay it should be long enough so don't worry about that but let's go ahead and check out what we're working with so let's open up this door there we go okay and by the way guys these mods can be found on uh like this mod can be found on I believe it's just like on mod network. If not, then mod hub. Uh, but it should just be a mod network, like most mods are. Okay, we're doing good. I like the interior. I like I like this truck actually quite a bit. This man. Um, I I don't know something about it. It just it, it just looks good to me. And you see, we have the two Garrett Place shipping containers over there. Uh, but okay, so we're gonna just kind of park this up over here. We'll kind of straighten it out a bit so it's not taking up so much of the road. But this doesn't need to be the best parking right now since we will be moving this here shortly uh here you know what actually we need we need some space to kind of move around so we're gonna park it up right along here just as straight as we can get it there we go uh actually here let's straighten out a bit more and let's back up a bit too if we can there we go please don't disalign there we go okay perfect so guys let's open up this garage and see what we're working with does this door work i don't even no i don't think so right no okay so let's just open up these. Uh, actually, I guess we only need this one open. But yeah, so in here, guys, in the storage shed. By the way, again, here is the update list with all of our current supporters. These are all everyone who, who's donated in some way. Either they bought merchandise, they joined a Patreon page, or they just did a, a one-off donation, or they were a channel member. Speaking of which, we have a join button on the channel, which is pretty cool. But guys, here they are. So each shipping container can hold two of these Can-Ams, and we have four of them because we have two shipping containers. Uh, so yeah, either way, we're going to hop in here. And yes, guys, the truck we're using is rated to be able to carry uh, all of this weight. So don't worry about that. I know we'll see some comments about it. It is rated to hold it, so we should be all okay. And guys, we're going to actually be squeezing this through this door if we can. We'll see if we fit. If not, we'll try going through that bigger door, but we should be okay. I guess it's kind of risky if we do it like this. But there we go. Okay. By the way, guys, uh, yesterday night, okay... So I was playing and stuff, I was about to record this video, and then it just, for some reason, everything just started freezing up on me and stuff. I don't know why, uh, but everything just got really, like, laggy. It was, like, stuttering, kind of, right? Like, I was having, like, 300 frames, it dropped down for, like, a split, split second, it dropped down to, like, pretty much having, like, no frames at all. Um, and then, like, pretty much, it just like went down to, like, 10 frames so it was just super laggy and then 
it instantly went back up to normal to like 300 or whatever. So it was kind of weird. I don't know why it happened. Um, it, it seems good right now at least. So we're going to hope for the best with this. But we'll have to see. We'll definitely have to see. Either way, uh, let's go for first again. I think we will just take this door because it just makes more sense, really, when you think about it. So there we go. Oh, yeah. By the way, somebody told me to put that generator back in the other shop. Um, I will. Do, somebody told me, though, to put, like, a different model one. Uh, so I will try working on that. Um, but as I say, guys, these videos are a bit more rushed because I'm going to be away. And I really should have started pre-recording videos a while ago. But I just wasn't thinking straight. So, yeah. Yeah, that's kind of what happened with that. Are we good? Mm, no, that, that should be moved further back here. Can we... Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's move this one back. There should be plenty of space. Yeah, we just don't know how to judge distance. Okay. And then this one should be able to go back to... Um, yeah, tons of space. Tons of space in there. Okay. So that one's good. And then we're going to grab our two other Can-Ams. So this should be pretty cool. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. By the way, guys, again, I will be reading all your comments once I get back. So don't worry about that. I'll... I'll like do my best, my absolute best to read all of your guys' comments when I get back. Uh, so feel free to leave those comments, cause yeah, no, like I, I, I will be reading them. It, I know it's gonna seem, I'm seem like I'm inactive for a few days, but don't worry, we're we're all good. <laughs> we are all good. Did I go through the small door there? I think I just did. Did I? I don't even remember what I just did. That's weird. Okay, I'll back this up though, so we know we can go a lot further back than we thought initially. So there we go. These fit really good in here. Like this kind of size vehicle is perfect for these. Okay. I think uh I think that's the best as we're gonna get it. And yeah, we just have one more to get, guys, so this should be pretty cool. Also, I don't remember this thing floating in the past, but now it is. So that's cool. Oh, also we used to have a this big um pallet like like thing. Um this big building there. And I said I was going to show it off in the next video on this map, but if you guys didn't realize, a few days ago, from when you're seeing this, I actually recorded, I uploaded a video where I was, um, I was, okay, here, no, let's not go through that small door. I, I used it on a different map. That's because I, when the lag issues were happening on here, I thought it was because of that shop. Turns out, it doesn't seem like it was. Uh, I did see, like, one or two errors, but I think it was about something different, um, but yeah, either way, so I removed it from this map. I, I don't know. Better safe than sorry. The issues are fixed now, but again, I don't think it was from that shop at all. Because it was happening on, like, all my different saves. And it, it didn't happen in the video uh, when I... Like, there's no lag issues in the video when I did use it. So, yeah, I don't know. It's kind of confusing. Either way, we're going to put that there. And then, yeah, I guess we're ready to go. So, okay, that's kind of far away. I don't know why I put that so far we're going to turn this on, though. There we go. We'll raise this up. And then, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, we should be able to close these up once we pick them up. Well, once we attach, we should be able to do this. So, here, actually, you guys want me to use this, I think. So, like, use this view. So, we'll try. Actually, here. We'll use this view to, like, get our, like, whole crane aligned. And then we'll switch it over. So there we go. Okay. Here, we'll see. We'll see how we can do. Okay. Uh, so yeah, this view. Oh, see, I don't know. I don't. I'm not a fan of this view. I'm not really a fan of this view. We'll see how it works. Maybe, maybe it will be better than I thought. Like, there's good parts. Like, it's good, but it's just I can't move around as much as with the other view, right? Um. Okay. Let's lower that down. Is that good? I think so. There we go. And we will close up those doors. There we go. They closed up. And let's lift this up. Perfect. Watch the angle. There we go. Okay. And let's back her up. I like it. I like it. Um, Should we put this one on the back or front? I'm guessing the front so we don't have to like slide. It so it won't be as difficult to slide in. Now the back, it does seem like it will attach. Um, even if it's not aligned correctly. Which means we need to align it correctly or else our weight will not be evenly distributed, which will cause issues. So, we'll go... Okay, what just happened? Okay, I've never seen that happen before. That's weird. That's very weird. Um, 
Okay, I have the no camera collision mod in. I don't know why it's doing that. But let's... Here, you know what? We'll try this view again. See, I... I don't know. I don't see it. No, no. We can't use that view. I don't like that view at all. Uh, yeah. We'll shift this over. Put it down. See how that is. Um, okay. Let's just kind of shift it back a little bit. And then I think we can even pull it in. Yeah, there we go. Okay. And we'll just drop it there. And then let's go inside of our vehicle if I can get out. And yes, lock it into place. There we go. Okay. So now we'll go ahead and pick up our next crate, our final crate. Actually, before I forget, let's close this door. There we go. Okay. And this thing is backing up, so that's great. I love hearing just the beeping sound. Okay, come on, don't don't hit that. Don't hit that. <laughs> um, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened there? This thing just drive away. Look at all the marks on this ground. Yeah, this is kind of crazy. Okay, there's a lot of marks on the ground. That is there a way to turn that off? Like Uh Dirt's on fast. Slow? I mean, I don't know. Where's like I don't even know. I put it on slow, but I think that's just for the time. What did I put it on? Uh, I put it on normal. Okay. It was on fast before, I think, right? So we'll see how this is. But, yeah, no. Kind of kind of weird. Either way, let's go ahead, guys, and attach this up. Uh, see, I like this view where I can, like, kind of just choose how I want it. <laughs> Lower that down. And I know, guys, it's saying I can attach already. And as I said in the past, uh, I want to make it realistic. So, or as realistic as I can, at least sometimes. So, yeah, that's why I kind of align it to the best of my ability, even though I don't have to. So, there we go. Should be good. We'll lower that down. Okay. I think that's good. Let's attach up. And then, let's close these doors. Goodbye, can -Ams. There we go. Perfect. Okay. And guys, I actually, with this uh, truck, I've tried putting one um, one of these shipping containers on, but I haven't tried putting two of them on. So we're going to see how it does. Also, guys, I have cleaned up the map a little bit, too. I've removed some stuff. We still have, like, all of our shipping containers, but all the vehicles that were just thrown around this map and stuff, I pretty much got rid of. So, yeah. Yeah, you guys will see. It should be better when we're driving. I think I got rid of all of them, at least. Or all of them that we should have got rid of i got rid of some extra ones that we will have to rebuy but it's it's whatever um okay that looks not good uh there we go okay i think no put it like that maybe yeah okay that should be fine there we go and then let's get in here let's open up our menu just so i do the right one uh attach okay so that should have them both locked, right? Yes. Okay, perfect. So we're going to want want to go ahead and move this away just because we don't want this to be in this position. So there we go. This never never turns and backs up. Good. But there we go. Okay. Uh, slide that in. And we will just position this over here. Perfect. Okay. So yeah, we're going to be bringing it to the shipping yard. Uh, oh, I forgot to close this door over here too. Should probably close this one. Let's quickly do that. Uh, which way is the trigger? This side? Yes. Okay. I, sh I, sh I should know because I did have to add the trigger on the outside. It was just on the inside. And I was like, why? How is that helpful? So there we go. And let's turn this on. Oh, I just hit my mic. My apologies. <laughs> okay. So let's start going, guys. We're looking all good. Uh, yeah, we'll see how this drives. It should be completely fine. We're more, like, we didn't even upgrade the engine on this, but it has, like, five upgrade options for the engine. It's kind of crazy. But, yeah, this is doing more than fine. I love it. I love it. Okay. Yeah, we're able to turn good. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, I think we could make a chain of these, because, look, there's another attachment there. Oh, that might, that might be something we have to do in the video. That sounds, that sounds cool. Okay. So let's go with those guys. Um, yeah, we should just be stable to go at normal speed because this thing should be able to get up to a decent speed at least. And then, yeah, th there should be no risk of these falling off because they're both locked in. It is a bigger load, but 
I don't know. I don't know. We're we're capable of driving this thing. There we go. I like the mirrors in here. Nice and big. Nice big mirror. Oh, lots of mirrors too. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. There we go. Okay, so it's just past this bridge, guys. By the way, I don't know if you guys know this. Um, In order for me to get the best audio... I did not realize how fast those brakes worked. Uh, in order for me to get the best audio for the videos and stuff, I actually have this, like, mesh... Like, uh, it's it's a called a pop filter, but it's it removes, like, any of, like, the weird, like, popping sounds in the video. Or it does the best it can. Sometimes it doesn't um, if I'm, like, too close or whatever, but it... It just makes the audio sound better, and it's this big mesh thing, uh, and it's, like, always in front of my face in the videos. I'm just so used to, like, seeing, like, around it and stuff. It's, I don't know, it's kind of weird. At first, it was just always so annoying, and for anyone who goes, sits at my desk or anything, they're always like, okay, why is that there? That's just terrible, but I don't know. I'm, I'm so used to it. There we go. I, some of them just look through the mesh, or some of them I, like, look around it. <laughs> okay, we're going to turn here. There we go. Okay, see, I forgot, like, this FedEx thing right here. But, like, that's I think there's actually one more FedEx container or something that's forgotten somewhere. But, like, there's no vehicles that are left around for no reason. No, at least to my knowledge. Okay. We turned okay there. Perfect. Give it a little honk on the horn. Can you guys not even hear this? You kind of can. There we go. <laughs> okay. Okay, I guess we'll do this for you. Let's see how this thing turns. There we go. Does this refill? Let's see. Can we refill our tank here? Because there is a gas thing. Doesn't look like it. Maybe we have to be closer. Not sure. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything to fill up. So maybe maybe that doesn't work. Who knows? Who knows? Okay, we're going to want to bring this around. Um, The best way to bring this. We usually just have to cut through there. We could go this way, though. I think we're going to go this way for a change. There we go. And then we can turn over here. Yeah, this video actually might be a bit longer, guys. This video might happen to be a little bit longer. So that's okay. That's okay. Usually these shipping videos are a bit longer. Let's see how we're doing, too. We're doing good. Okay. Just making sure there's no vehicles glitching through the containers or anything. Usually they're pretty good at that, which is rare to see because most... Most of most mods, like the collisions for stuff, uh, is kind of wanky and like stuff can just like shoot through it, the containers or not like containers, but like whatever crate stuff's usually in, it usually can just shoot through. But here we go. Let's unlock. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, how do I do this? Okay. Uh, unload here. Would that do it? No. That does not seem to do anything. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, that works. And then, I think. Um, oh, it's, I think it's only, which one detached? I can't tell. How do I know? I think that one's attached. I think this one is probably detached right now. We will see. We will see here shortly. Okay, let's go ahead and get into this thing. Perfect. And yeah, we're just going to place these beside all of the other containers um yeah see this is what i'm talking about with the backing up sometimes it struggles a bit we weren't even turning when backing up at first and it just was struggling here we go we'll see how fast we can oh see like this is me trying to drive there we go okay yeah i don't know with the turning sometimes like unless you have speed built up it doesn't always do the best there we go okay we're gonna want to lower this down let's we'll see let's we'll see how fast we can do this I still want to do a good job. Like, we could attach now, but why would I? Um, okay, we have to angle that. Lower that down. Um, okay, I think that's good. Let's lift that up. Perfect. Okay. For some reason, the weight of this thing seems a little bit off. Doesn't... It seems like it was, like, slanted on the trailer or something, too. I, I don't know what's happening with this. I really don't know. <laughs> There we go. Okay. How do we want to do this? Um, How should we do this? I guess just... Can we take this train here or do we need back up? Come on. You got this. Don't hit the other container. No. No. Don't. Don't. Don't hit the other container, I said. <laughs> here we go. Okay. I'm still going to hit something that... I'm, I'm going to mess up somehow. 
There we go. Okay. Change the angle. Alright, guys, I'm getting so much better driving this thing. There we go. Okay. I'm happy with that. It could be probably shifted over a bit, but that's okay. So we're going to want to... Oh, we actually still have to detach this last container. Uh, yeah, let's do that. We'll just hop on out. And I think that should be good. So there we go. Let's go back in this video. Is that a K? I keep seeing this. It looks like it's a K. I don't know. I'm probably wrong. It, lo it looks like a K to me. Or it's just probably the design, honestly. Um, okay, can we reach this from this weird angle we're at? Let's see. Yes, we can. Okay. This is a very weird angle. Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't be shifting that over yet. There we go. Okay. Slow and steady wins the race, guys. Slow and steady. Even though we're trying to do this a bit faster. Okay, lower that down. That should be... Uh, here, yeah, let's shift that over. Hmm. Okay. I think... I think that that's good. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Let's pick it up. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay. And we'll just quickly place this one down as well. We have all the doors facing the same way, which I like. It makes it easy to... It, it, I don't know. It just having the direction like this is always good. Okay. It's luckily not too heavy of a container. These big ones sometimes, if you put a lot in it, they could be quite heavy. I haven't even ever tested, like, what's the max weight these can hold. Maybe we'll move some heavy containers in a future video. Like, we just put, like, a ton of weights in there. Right? Just, like, literally just test its limits. But, guys, either way, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are awesome. Let me know what you think of these trucks. Bye-bye. Want to keep up with the latest Garrett Plays videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. If you want to see extra content, join our Patreon page.